Welcome back, everyone. We are back with more Cyberpunk 2077 in Judy's storyline. We have just rescued Evelyn. So we're gonna go talk with Judy. She's sleeping. Uh, at least I think she is. Her eyes are closed and she's not shaking anymore. I would have already killed her by now if I didn't feel so bad for her. How's she feeling? Use your imagination. That place sucked every last drop of humanity from her. It's not enough. She already gave up everything she had. I just kept taking more and more. She's in some kind of trance, like she's folded into herself. No reaction to her surroundings whatsoever. I really, really didn't want to poke around in her head. I did it for you. I just want you to know that. You're mad at her. Why? When you asked me to scour her behavioral chip, I was just about done dealing with your shit. Judy, I didn't have any- I know. Other... It's okay. So I don't get why- You'll find out in a sec. I'll show you the virtue I found. How many BDs did you manage to rip? Two. Only one of them's intact. Understandable, though. The rest... Well, they're in the same shape as Evelyn right now. Guessing you saw them already. Yeah. Had to wrestle to make sense of the whole thing. But I don't want to say anything and taint your perspective. You should go in with fresh eyes. Okay. Show me. Give me a sec while I set the parameters. Guess we'll find out if our doll really did lose her tune. Come on, V. Hey. I'll be the first to admit, How you this feeling? does not look good. Need anything? Not here to nag. Just talk. Ooh. Listen, Evelyn, I really need your help. It's important. If I don't do anything and do it soon, I'll die. Well, now, look at you. Have a seat. All right, roll it. Data was in pretty rough shape. Not all that editable. Huh. Glad you managed to salvage him in the first place. Needs a second to load. Quality's lousy, but I did what I could. What am I looking out for? Take a look around if you want. Can't see her face. <sighs> Under normal circumstances, that kind of encryption's easy to crack. But not this time. Whoever she is, she's got serious net running skills. That, or someone's working it for her. <sighs> I think I recognize these. What are they? Vive markings. You familiar with them? Not enough to know what they actually mean. Heard of who might use them, though. Who? Could be the Voodoo Boys, but that's just a hunch. Can't be 100% sure. 
The spine chilling Netrunner crew? Hard to find because they don't want to be. I wouldn't know where to start. Every single piece of tech I see, security. We need a layout of the whole room. We will get everything else we need from the virtue. What about his messages? Only if you can do it and be parfait bully. It's most important that he suspect nothing. Try to be your usual relaxed self. And if he starts talking about the biochip himself? Might not be important. Maybe, but all of them are from Pacifica. Narrows down our search, at least. What now? Looks like I'm going on a field trip to Pacifica. Brain dances are really cool in this game. Hope they have some really cool ones in the DLCs. All right, think we got everything. What do you think? Now we know what happened at Clouds. They're the ones who tried to flatline her. Launched a nuke at her chip. So it was punishment? For getting played by her? She knew more than they thought she knew. Couldn't let that go. So that's who she was running from. Woman who hired Evelyn. Any idea who we're up against? Your guess is as good as mine. Sorry, V. Looks like Evelyn never told us the whole truth. You're telling me. If I'd known what she'd gotten herself into... Oh, I'm so mad at her. Her only job was to record a virtue. Pretty damn amazing she managed to organize a full-blown heist. And swipe the biochip from under her boss's noses. So that's where you came in. She hired you, and brought this all on herself, on you two. There's one more recording. Wanna see it? Sure, why not? Nothing can surprise me at this point. Judy, you okay? Dying of a heart attack? Oui, oui, allez. What language is she speaking? I don't know. Haitian Creole. It is the Voodoo Boys. Didn't I? Wait, let me see if I've got an auto translator. Meantime, you try to tune into the phone's frequency. See what the other side's saying. Got it. Give it a second. Heard her mention you're a Nobu. Probably why Evelyn buried this recording deep. Caught another name. Something like Silverhand? We have to know what they're saying. Could be important. Fine. Just found the auto-translate package. Should get along fine with your system. I'll install it now. That would be awesome if we could do that in the future. Oui. Oui, allez. Vous avez une raison, mon zé tout intelligent. Vous pensez, mon zé, la femme qui a un problème? Mon zé pas enragé. Mon pli. C'est le pire bon moyen nous gagner pour nous arriver sur yon nos bouts. Where else does it want me to scan? We tell me quite même j'avais au que si le vent amène nous direct sous alt. Vous gagnez un bon idée? Très bien. Si vous décidez si c'est bon que tu qu'est-ce que tu penses? I'll continue to fit my Bible. Okay, Judy, we're good. All right, disconnecting. I don't get it. What's this have to do with Johnny Silverhand? He died, like, forever ago. V, hey, you got any idea? Biochip we stole. It's got Silverhand's engram burned onto it. Engram? Digitized psyche. Personality construct. Can you 
Give me a minute. I need to go over some stuff in my head. Uh, um, of course. So that chair is pretty cool. What they should have done is Secret Labs, which is a gaming chair I use, did a collaboration with, with CD Projekt Red and Cyberpunk, and they did a they did a uh, a special chair, special release. They should have put that in the game. You know who they are? Who the woman is? Any idea how we find them? Fuck V. I've been dead the last half century. Sorry if I'm unable to hand you all the answers on a chrome fucking platter when you snap your fingers. These people, what could they want from Alt? How the hell should I know? Got no notion whatsoever? One way or another, everything leads back to that Netrunner. Finding her is our biggest priority. If she knows as much as I think she knows about the chip, she can help us out. Thought you said nothing could help us. Nah, just find us that juju wirehead, okay? He's got some cool comics. Dr. Havoc. It's cool the detail they put in this. Creep on her. So this is Evelyn to Judy. Hey, it's been like a thousand years since we saw each other. What's up with you, girl? You still cooped up in Susie's basement? Still with Maiko? Hoping at least one of these things isn't true anymore. So I've got a tiny favor to ask. Okay, it's more like a humongous favor. Super important to me, but should be a breeze for a geek like you. Holler back at me. So Judy says, hey Eve. Mind straight up just telling me what's going on? This got anything to do with your previous messages? And yes, one of those things isn't true anymore. So, Avalon responds, I need you to scroll a virtue for me. That's it, I promise. In exchange, I'll make sure you don't have to do anything for the rest of your life but art. Let's just meet, okay? Where can I find you these days? Susie's basement. I'm not going to read all of these, but I'll just scroll them. And if you want to pause and read, you can. So once we Wait, complete... you got any idea how to get in touch oh, with the Voodoo talk. Boys? I'll ask around. Make a few calls. Let me put it this way. The Voodoo Boys wouldn't trust a cat if it walked onto their turf. But someone's gotta know a way in. Well, good luck. I hope you won't need it. See you around, Judy. Right. Um... Thanks. V. So, once we complete... I've never gotten Judy's iconic shotgun, but it'll be on this table once we do... I don't know if you have to romance her or just finish the storyline. Didn't know she dabbled in robotics. Now that's fucking Shimra. Think that's how she winds down? After a day's work of tuning hardcore smut? Wouldn't be surprised. No. Oh, interesting. Place looks like a fucking antique museum. I guess you should feel right at home. 
chick's got taste. Except for one thing. And what's that? The way she looks at you. Don't pretend you haven't noticed. Makes you all mushy inside. I can feel it. Judy is bae after all. She's a cool character. They did a really good job with character designs in this game. Futuristic kitchens look badass too. herself to express Stop her. talking. I was, I was only gone an hour. How did this happen? I don't know. I told you. Evie was lying in bed like always when I went out. And I got back to... <gasps> Fuck. If I'd just known, I'd have... Don't blame yourself won't solve anything. I should have sensed something. That it was off. <laughs> Stop. Couldn't watch her 24-7. She'd made up her mind. Would have found a way. Always. Gotta do something with her. Don't want any trouble. <laughs> I'm calling the badges. Can you carry her to the bed? As if that'll change anything. Yeah, I, I need to report an accidental death. North side, Jackson Street. No. No imminent danger. Suicide. Tomorrow? No! Today! What part of dead don't you understand? No, she was not pronounced dead by trauma team. If she'd have had coverage, we wouldn't be talking. And fuck you! If you don't want to move your asses, why don't I come down to the precinct and trash it into bits? Now will you come and arrest me, you pussies? Fine, I don't give a fuck what you write me up for. <sighs> They'll be here soon. <laughs> they told me to keep her on ice until tomorrow. Can you believe the balls? Welcome to Night City, where your address says more about you than anything else. We should have never come here. I'm gonna put something on her. I'd rather she look like a person than a body. Could you wait outside? Close the door, V. Please. I'm a cig. Didn't know you smoked. Uh, quit. It's been years. But right now I need something besides air in my lungs. Please, V, just one. Fine, here. That was her smoke case. 
Want to hold on to it? No. You seem to like it. Keep it. Kind of glad it's you that has it, actually. I let her down. I thought if I gave her some t space or time, she'd get back on her feet. Stay strong, Judy. Don't let this tear you down. Now what? Let's just not say anything for a minute, okay? In her condition, couldn't think about anything else. Tech-wise, she was clean. Dalshard was operational, uncorrupted. So, psychological trauma had to be that. Did some more digging in her virtues, found Woodman. He kept her and had his way with her. The things he did. And once he got bored, he pawned her off. What did Woodman do to her? Did you see it? Yeah. And I really wish I could unsee it. Wait, so you found other recordings? Had another look at the corrupted ones. You know, lots of static. Hard to pick up anything, really. At some point, I stumbled on something like an echo of the spat we'd had. Last time we saw each other. But I know she wasn't scrolling. Why was it saved as a virtue? Got no explanation for it. Maybe she recalled it later, relived it, almost. Implant could have been on when, you know, as a defense mechanism, escaping into the past so as not to live in the present. I had no idea that guy was such a monster. Saw him as your... Average Trixie sleazebag. It puts on a convincing facade. I knew him, but I never thought him that sick in the brain. Gotta be something I can do about it. Like what? Don't know yet. Think I'll call Sue's. Thanks, V. Sorry, but uh, I'd rather be alone now. Promise to keep in touch. Sure you don't need anything? No, but sweet of you to ask. Anything comes up, holler on the hollow. Thank you everyone for watching this video. If you enjoyed watching, hit the like and subscribe button so you'll be notified of the next video and any future content coming. Follow me on Twitch, Get Yo Shinebox. Follow me on Twitter, at Get Yo Shinebox too. Thanks, everyone.